Good evening, guys. Welcome back to Prospects E Racing League. Now we're live for Tier 4 Round 6 in Miami. Tonight, joining me live is Chappers. Good evening, Chappers. Good evening, everybody. And it's good to be back again for another round for Tier 4. Absolutely. How are we all doing, guys? Welcome in. Five of you so far. Uh, we've got MZ say Miami Tier 4. Let's go. Uh, just call me saying, just saying, what's up? <laughs> Welcome in, guys. Uh, give me two seconds. That's my worries. So how are we all doing on this fine Thursday evening, or Thursday night, I should say, for you guys in the UK? Um, it's going to be an interesting one tonight. We've got a few interesting races this week here in Miami, and I think the Tier 4 guys are going to put on a good show for us. Numbers are a little lower than usual again this week, but it is holiday season, so I think a few drivers are away at the moment. But uh, yeah, it's going to still be a bit of an action pack race, I think. Sippo is just away. I will keep you guys. Oh, back. So I'm um, just um, <clears throat> having munching my fun a little bit of food there. <laughs> no worries. No worries it at is all. The night, of course. Yep. And is indeed. Let's see what the weather will be because I believe that the oh. tier three yesterday in the qualifying was a bit rainy. So oh, we actually had a wet one, did we? Yeah, yesterday in the qualifying, I believe. I'm unsure about the race. I can't remember off the top of my head, but I know that the qualifying was a bit rainy. So. Oh, nice. Well, we've had no rain yeah. at all this week in comparison to what I've done. Um, and it looks okay. overcast, but it doesn't look wet. Now, hopefully, Villeneuve isn't raining. Oh, Villeneuve is raising. Um, let us know what's the weather doing, Villeneuve. If not just Comey Sand, let us know what the weather's doing. Um, yeah. MZ, or even MZ, either of you three guys, let us know what's happening. Um, it'll be interesting to yeah. uh, keep us updated. I mean, again, it's just something that's it's so simple to introduce, and they just can't do that. Yeah, it is just interesting. Though. I'm going to go to track. the the website because a couple of the championship contenders aren't here this evening. I believe that one of them is here, so it's a bit of a opportunity. I'm going to see what the actual championship are at the moment. Um, and I just wonder, can we get chaos? Curse again. Oh god, um, I mean, you tried giving me the curse on Tuesday, I believe, um, before, and the briefing it didn't quite work. So, hopefully, if we do, if you do give Chaos that curse, uh, it won't work again. So, Miami might bring in a bit of luck, I think. It might shine the curse away. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it can't, it's not too difficult to work with. Oh god. Yeah, I mean you do it pretty well to be fair. You've, you've cursed a fair few people this year already and I'm, I'm sure that number will stack up pretty high towards the end of the season. Well I've actually started a series on TikTok. Have you? <laughs> yeah, it's actually good. Yeah. Uh, yeah You've actually been serious though? No, yeah, I've started a series up on TikTok. It's literally the um it's it's the curse of Zippo part one and part two. So far, okay. but I've got so many videos where I've been online on board this one, but I've made fun. I must have about, I don't know, another 12, 13 videos. Oh my god. Various different what? leagues, it's crazy. Jesus, man. That's insane. But yeah, I mean, just come Sam coming around to, uh, to finish off the first uh, outlap of the evening. Uh, good evening, Baguette. Uh, TD Boy, come on, TD Silver. I mean, look, TD Boy, TD Silver. Oh my god. Um, you're carrying the team. There's lots of teeters. teeters. There is in the team. So yeah, uh, Teeter Silver in the pits at the moment. Teeter Boy absent this evening. Um, I'm not sure whether he's won the championship. I don't think he is, is he? I'll have a look. The Discord on my Discord's loading pretty slow at the moment. Uh, it's, it's loading. It's going in that slow. He's actually just dropped the call. Um, so hopefully he will be back in very soon. <coughs> um, but for the time being, it's just going to be me in here on the with you um, until Chappers obviously does come back into the call. Um, but yeah, just kind of stand on our lap at the moment as he's going through sector two, uh, coming towards that tricky, tricky uh, chicane section here. As you can see on board with just kind of stand around through the um, round through the, uh, the 
UK now down onto the back straight. DRS will be opening up. Chappers has left the session, so I wonder if he's had maybe a power cut or, or something. But uh, we'll roll with this for now. Just so the cone is down towards the final few corners. DRS only reaching speeds excess of 200 miles an hour, 205 in the braking zone there as he comes round. Powering down, DRS will be enabled once again in a second as he does come through to set a Hello. 30.7 Hello. and I have no back. idea. I have no idea what went on there. My whole Discord and everything just crashed. Well, he crashed out of the lobby as well, so I'm not sure what's happened on your, on your side. He's not actually in the lobby but, anymore either. I didn't know I've just gone on to my 4G. So, as, uh, I'm going to see this back up. Sorry, Vilnuff out. Vilnuff sets the fastest lap so far, 30.2. MK7 God, 30.5 in second. Just Clemmy Sand in third. Booth X in fourth. Tilmo down there in sixth place now as Kai 28.5. My god, 1.3. Wow. One point, okay, never mind. Zippy into second place, 9 tenths quicker. Uh, and it was 1.6 faster than Vilma, who was currently sat there in second place. Do you even know Yes, I do indeed, unfortunately. And that was MZ in to second place there as well. I'll and see if I can join through the actual thing. No, it's, it's closed off. You've got one there. You should have one now. Yeah, let's see if uh, it's coming MZ through. MZ goes into second place three tenths, on. actually, uh, just behind Kai. Um, see what else is going on who have we got coming towards the end that is mellowed space stays ninth fastest next up we have got just komi san actually on a second run it says i can't connect to the servers has your wi-fi gone down by the way i don't know i'm online it's just not letting me connect to the game you may have to restart your playstation that or i don't know what's going on carnage Kitty coming down to the line uh, do I want to become famous by viewers, followers, and primes on my stern tour? Do you want to become banned? Send silly messages like that. There we go. And I have permission to do that. That is exactly the same person that I banned on my own stream um, on Tuesday evening. Um, seems to be like one of those bots that's going around just uh, spamming buys and trying to sell viewers and things like that. I mean, that's never the way to build a, cha uh, a channel up. Carnage Achilles in 13th has validated this lap. We've gone forward with Tita Silva, who goes fourth fastest uh, at 30.0 there. Chaos Druid down there in 11th place. Mellow Space in 12th. Mason in 10th. Uh, who have we had? We've had Ziffy go into third place. Villeneuve down into fifth place now. And uh, Tita Silva on an inland currently sat in fourth place. Kai leading the way at 28.5, three tenths ahead of MZ in second place. And uh, Carnage on your validation, coming round through the back straight, uh, probably just uh, warming himself back up to go again. Uh, I'm not sure what's happening with Chappers. He's in the pool, but it seems like his PlayStation isn't connected to the service at the moment. Yeah, it's not. I've taken the screenshot and stuff. I've just restarted my PlayStation again. So I'm hoping it all works. Why I got this game. Oh, excuse me. We're looking at the work. Yeah, I'm back in. Um, I just need to have another invite because that one didn't come through. Okay, right. Let's Hang on, I think I might be able to join. I think I can through the PlayStation. We've got you an invite. Thank you, that, anyway. that's gone through now. That's gone through now. Nice. So, yeah, Chappers is now rejoining us. So, Carnage into the pits. On an outlap is just Komi San. He's down there in seventh place at the minute. I've clicked spectate before I actually click to join the section. Oh, so, God, hopefully, yeah, it, it, keeps, hopefully it keeps me from staying in the spectator mode and not putting me on the grid like it's done in the past for a few people that's happened to, but uh... But it happened Monday does night. put me on the grid. Yeah, it happened Monday oh, did night it? tier 1. Uh, no, no, sorry. Um, it happened Tuesday night, I think. Or was it Wednesday? Okay, well, if it does happen to me, I'll just keep out everybody's way. I'll get back anyway. Just keep Hello, a long chaos. gap to everybody and 
bang it in the pits and retire. Absolutely, yeah. So just Kobe Sam for the lead car on an hour. Guys, it's Thursday, it only means one thing. What did you guys have for dinner tonight? Enchiladas. Enchiladas. That's, that's, that's not bad. Actually, I saw your pictures. You have a fish and grill. Um, oh, yeah, we have. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we have the fish and grill. So yeah. you, you have a fish and grill food bag? Yes. Okay, and uh, I'm going to place an order for delivery, please. So, uh, you will definitely be delivering to me at some point. Definitely going to place an order and you have to deliver. Oh. Mm. Um, mm. So, yeah, guys, what did we have for dinner tonight? So we had, excuse me, enchiladas for chapels. Um, I had a Chinese chicken stir fry. Mm. What did everybody else do? Don't all talk at once. What the future popping off? It's definitely not. Can you still hear me okay? Uh, yeah, you're a little bit um, broken, okay. but it's okay. Hey, I, I just had to move my other headphone in because uh, what's going on today with my just stuff? It's, it's all kind of. The end. Uh, he's down. The, uh, he's down on the pit straight. He's currently a tenth and a half up on his time. Um, so that is only going to put him potentially six passes. Zippo, why am I so quiet in comparison to Chapman? I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. You, you, you actually right. said the other day about me being really quiet, and I, oh. I reckon it's either your hearing or your phone. Because I was on board, I was doing it elsewhere, and it was absolutely fine. I, I had the stream up myself, and it was fine. I reckon it's definitely you, Simon. I think he's just trying not to hear, hear you because of the amount of curse you've given him. I reckon, to he's doing it. I reckon he's just, you know. Yeah. Deliberately saying that you can't hear me. Mark Seven God, no, it's not. It's Mason. Oh, it's Mason on out uh, Next up, we're going to have Kai. Maybe, yeah. Kai coming towards the end of his lap. Uh, he's currently up. Provisional pole position sits at uh, 28.5 to beat. I think he's going to beat that. Yes, he is. At 27.9. So he did obviously do the academy race just prior to this. Um, and uh, yeah, he was uh, he was re relatively quick in the in the. Uh... Oh, I'm glad he wasn't on another flying lap just there because that was. Uh... Can we nerf Kai? I mean, you can nerf Gun Kai, I guess. Um, I don't know if we can nerf Kai, but we can definitely like shoot his tires out or something. If, you, if any of you guys have got one of those uh, those nerf guns, then yeah, by all means, um, go for it. Uh, Villeneuve in fourth place at the moment going through sector one. He's just finished that match. Uh, Carnage Achilles, let's have a look at you. So what you'll do is you're going through sector one now. You've got your teammate of Spoofex just ahead of you. See what you can do. Uh, you did invalidate your first one. Spoofex has most definitely invalidated this one. And uh, hopefully he's going to stay out of the way of his teammate. Yes, he does. and does very well indeed. Yep. Yeah, Carnage the only one not to set a lap on the field, so... He's got five minutes left to set this up, but he seems like he is definitely on a flyer and he is still valid. So, um, yeah, this track's quite interesting, especially when you uh, get to all tyres in the race. But, um, so it's a new track this year, um, it's Miami, so it's an interesting one for all the drivers this week. Um, you can see the, the, the time difference between the whole field and, and the, in all the tiers, pretty much. It's been, a lot more spaced out than what it normally is. Uh, yeah, so, definitely. um, but that should be out of a new track coming, I mean, I mean, isn't it? And who can adjust to it quickly or quicker than others, pretty much. I mean, the we, now we, we, saw a, the corner. Um, we saw MZ, no, it wasn't, it was a Quasar, no, it was Jonas. Oh, I don't think you're supposed to do in that carnage. Oh. It's very interesting there. Ooh, late, uh, late. MK7 God crashing out of the session. Uh, we're going to go on board with uh, Chaos Druid. And there is that stricken uh, Red Bull there in the middle of the track. And uh, yeah, that's not a great ending to his qualifying in a wall. Um, I'm not sure what is K 
Chaos, do it. Look, the idea, mate, is to stay in between the white lines there, Chaos. Uh, you don't want to be over there. Oh, you're telling all the things, there, you? <laughs> He's on a lap right now. But... Uh, on a lap, we've got Tilmo, uh, who's actually bailing out of this lap, so he's not on a lap now. Just Tony San on a lap. Coming no, to the exactly. end of his lap is Mason, but he's going to the pits. No, just Komi San going through there. Uh, Tilmo yeah, he's, he's 2.1 off. Yeah, Komi San's 2.1 off in the first sector. Zippy's invalidated. MZ, he's invalidated as well. So it is just I mean, Komi San. Nobody's on a lap. Komi San was 2.1 off in the first in the first sector. So it, it, it seems like he's already bailed out. Uh, no, it seems uh, nobody's really on a map at the minute. Um, no, it's not. Chaos is on an out map at the moment. Yeah, he's just coming to the end of his out map, so... Um, we'll Chaos is probably our best bet. Uh, Sorry, yeah, Chaos, Chaos, but we all want to riding on board with. Yeah, so uh, let's hope he didn't say for okay, seven hours. We go on board with Chaos if he does start his flying lap on these fresh set of soft tyres. Chaos currently sat in tall position at the 132.3. Definitely looking to improve at that time for sure. It's going to be an interesting one here because it's a very, very hard track to nail. It gets on the curb, the rear sliding a little bit there. Wheel of Mock 7 God still on the track, so the marshal's still not clear that wheel up, and it's um, the usual F122 glitch, the level 21, where you go straight through it. Um, car Chaos now coming down the back straight. Almost touching the DRS zone any moment now. Here it comes, the fours are here. Now, as you fix on DRS, again, that edge and speed down the straight, that rear wing opens. This section here I find is really challenging as well. Do you agree? Or... Uh, yeah, definitely. You don't want to be going towards the here either. Oh, no, definitely not. It's um one of those sectors where it's just a normal taking area, really. This bit here, you can actually cut a bit of that corner and keep it valid. Um, yeah, it's a horrible part of the section. The Miami, the Miami, yeah, uh, Miami chicane is horrible. Do it so yeah. far, keep it nice and clean. Keep it on the track. Not too many um, slip and slide. Um, hopefully, no. you can continue off coming out the final corner with out dropping it. Yeah, let's see. Now he's coming out the final corner now. Coming into a not place. really oh, such no, long session. front show. Mm. Oh, 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 hang on a minute, there's another space lead in the session. Chaos moves into 8th though with a 130.3, so... Good improvement there for Chaos Steward. Yeah, absolutely, I'll tell you what. Oh, we're getting lots of drivers leaving the session here. We've had three drivers leaving the session in the last like, 15 seconds. That's not a good sign. Mm. Uh, Mason retiring from the session. Just gonna check the chat to make sure nothing's, nothing's going on. I can't on. see that the chat, so you have to let us know what's Just going on. Just kicked me, yeah. Uh, I skipped too hard with any passion, but right. So, so a couple of drivers. Oh, they're back in now. But yeah, drivers just. Uh, Yeah, they're going back into the session. Just, uh, just, uh, just the game being the game, I think. Absolutely. Scoot X, uh, just ahead of... Um, is that Tilmo just ahead? Yeah, so Tilmo, then it's going to be Spoof X. On a lap, though, but Zippy out. That's big. That is big. He's, he's done that on yeah. track. He's done that on track. Oh. Tilmo hasn't improved. Spoof X goes sixth. So he's improved. Um, oh, Carnage well, Achilles. Crash. Yeah, he's not actually crashed. He retired on track. Well, okay, that will be one for the stewards to be looking at for sure. Carnage Achilles. I and mean, he's still the only driver to not set about a lap in the session. Uh, the flags have been waved, so it's all or nothing now for the Ferrari driver. He's sat in 13th currently, so um, 
Miller space goes back into the lobby. A lot of retires on this ground from this qualifying session, actually. A lot of retirements. Um, the amount of people that were here for sure, but uh, oh, yeah, no, hopefully, the, hopefully, the race proves to be a bit better than these retirements, though, guys. Um, Monday night in particular, um, we started off with 12, finished with six. Here comes Carnage, he goes third fastest. Wow. Ooh, so he saved that best till last. As uh, Tilmo's going to be out of the session, he's eight and a half seconds down on this time. Uh, Chaos says, I improved because I then remembered to switch from my DRS on. Uh, well, that's always a good thing if you uh, put your DRS on, mate. Right? It's uh, yeah, I'm normally meant to go quick after that. <laughs> that is the qualifying done if Telmo is not on the flying lap. Yeah, he is. It's it. So, uh, okay. Kai on yeah. pole position by quite a considerable amount of time. Eight, almost nine tenths to MZ. So, could we see already an out and out winner? However, so far in tier one and tier two, the driver that started on pole position hasn't won the race. That's big. That is big. So. Will we see a repeat pattern? Oh, and Academy, actually. And the Academy, wow, okay. I'm not sure about Tier 3. I don't know off the top of my head. But yeah, those drivers that are on pole position did not go ahead and win the race. So, very interesting to see whether that curse can be broken tonight. However, I'm on comms. With you, it's never going to happen. Definitely not. Definitely not. But as I said, here is your grid for today's race, tier four at Miami. The last race of the week before we move over for Monza next week. It's gonna be an interesting race here for sure to round off this week's race in uh, Sakai nearly nine tenths quicker than anybody else in this qualifying section, which is a considerable amount of time in an F1 car for sure. Um but yeah, if I can get onto the website, it's going to be really interesting here because, as I said, a couple of the championship contenders aren't here this evening, so it's a big weekend for a couple of drivers in here, or especially one of the drivers in here. If I can just be where the website is at the moment. There we are. Look on tier 4 for you all. Remember, guys, formation lap is now on. It's been switched back on this week after the recent fix as uh, we're going to have the formation lap. And no, I can't curse baguette tonight because there is no baguette racing, unfortunately. Um, but yes, we can't. We can we can curse you instead, Chaos. So, you know, we, we will go for it. Yeah, it's not loading for me. I don't know what is going on at my end tonight. It's it's rather frustrating. Here we are. Drivers. So we've got Vintage who is not here on 86 points. With Paige who's not here on 65 points. Carnage Achilles on 61 points. With Zippy on 56. So it is a huge... So Carnage putting that car into the top into the top four. Uh, yeah, so it's Carnage in, yeah, Carnage in P3 and Zippy in P4 in the championship and that's where they are on the grid today. Yeah, brilliant. So, so it's yeah, a big very, race. very um, interesting the lineup. Let's see. Can we have... Why is this on broadcast? This is supposed to be immersive. Oh, dear. Okay, so Zippy on the softs. Well, I will tell you guys, but this, is, this was meant to have been immersive, not broadcast. Uh, the only good thing is there is no vintage. Yeah. How you doing, Craigie? Oh, I should walk over my road. So then, there's the uh, AI lines the drivers up on the grid. We will be getting ready to. Start the last race of this week. It is tier four. We're at Miami. It's round six, I believe. It is, yeah. And we are raring to get this show 
underway for you guys as the lights will come on very, very soon. Going to be an interesting one, as I said, big race for Carnage and Zippy, and it is. Four lights, guys. three yeah, lights, three, yeah, four, five, and it's lights out. Away we go for the Miami Grand Prix, and it is a good start for Kai. In the McLaren, he's got a massive hole shot on the rest of the field, but the Haas driver hitting his rear and having a bit of a moment there has Vicky. He's jumped into P2, amazing with a five second time penalty already for a severe it's, collision with it's NZ. Got very, very messy at the back there. I was on board with Chaos oh, throughout has. all of that. Mason, Mason hit NZ, who's now all the way down in 12th place with just Komi San. Uh, Chaos gets a really good start though. He did, he did clip the rear of NZ as well himself. Um, yeah. So sent sent Alpha Town the driver in for a bit of a spin. Kai already 1.5 clear. Wow, yeah. Crazy. Andrew Kinney's though on T to Silva. Looking to the outside, looking to the inside. Hard it gets hard. Looking to the outside, inside, outside, inside, outside. As T to Silva breaks very, very early. As uh, Carnage Achilles rounds the inside and gets the move made. And that is Carnage Achilles up into third place. That is a huge move for him. Absolutely huge for him. We've got yellow flags. And that is for Villeneuve, I think, as uh, Carnage actually takes one of the bollards with him. As T to Silva almost pushing. Um, almost pushing Carnage through that front, through that corner there as Chaos Druid and Spoof X changing positions. Chaos up two places into sixth place now as uh, Tita Silver gets back into third place and Carnage back down into fourth. Uh, catch up on the chat as well here, guys, as uh, Chappers continues on with that. As there's contact. Yep. Oh, where well, was this? Oh, wow, there is more contact. It's all kicking off here in tier four. Can and we're only that the point. Pits. Only Carnage in the pits, yep. It's not the start Carnage would have been looking for because it's a huge race for him and Zippy, and Zippy is taking full advantage of that at the moment. Zippy actually going on soft, so that's a very bold decision, and Carnage has jumped onto the softs already, so, um, yeah. Very interesting decision there. Yeah, so they, uh, he must be hoping for that one, but, uh, yeah, top two on the mediums and Zippy on the softs, so... He's three, he's Denmark, still on the West Haiti. Holland as well, by the way. He's Danish, not, mm. not Dutch. Um, Tilmo Ooh. against MZ. Oh, Tilmo actually clipped the wall that almost shot over into MZ. He's going to have the inside line here. Inside line into the braking zone, but he's not brave enough on the brakes as X. Uh, sorry, Spoof X. Ooh. Oh, Tilmo gets really out of shape there. Mellow yeah. Space gets oh. through. Oh. Mellow space Mellow's into the wall. Moment. And there wow. goes his Oh, and he's like got wing damage. Yeah, he's got a bit of side pod damage from that. So uh, that's not the start the Aston Martin driver would have wanted. It's all kicking off here. Uh, Spoof X has had a moment as well. Spoof X at the exit of um, the uh, left-hander. The mighty blue left-hander off the back straight. MK7 God almost getting close to Tita Silva. Well, he is not almost. He is close to Tita Silva. Kai and Zippy now sets the part of that 31-7. That gap between the, uh, the first and second coming down very quickly 6.7 third place though wow that's that's crazy and those two are as well they are on that medium and soft tire so in a few laps time they will say kai will have that advantage over over zippy and he has all the way from that in that drs zone now so zippy won't have drs on kai this time around he's got to put a lot of work in i think to be able to get that drs but i do feel once he does get within that DRS range, if he does get it in the next couple of laps, I'm sure he will pass Kai, but then those softs will degrade a bit quicker than those mediums, and then Kai will have the advantage. So uh, yeah, it's absolutely. an interesting little situation between these two front guys at the moment. Yeah, and it's interesting to see Carnage. Interesting to see Carnage on those soft tyres. I think that's a... Oh, as Tita Silva sort of closes the door to MK7 got there. Yeah. Um, just Comey San against Spoof X as well down here for 9th and 10th place. Um, yep. Getting pretty close. They're going to be coming through the chicane now, so uh, Comey's going to have um, the DRS down the straight. Is he going to be able to put a move in? It's hard against hard. Um, I think. Uh, see, I think Comey San is a better exit out there than that, to be honest. Yeah, he could have, but. Um... He has got the DRS, but uh, he's not he has just now. 
he won't be close enough for sure, I don't think. He will, uh, if he can get a good first sector, I'm sure we'll be able to get him a, on the next back straight. Is he even right on me? Great of spoof now, and to be fair, if he's close enough, he could potentially get him. He's not close enough. Let's say if he was close enough, he could have got him on the straight. Chaos but, against um, MZ, though. This is going through turns one, two, and three. Ooh. There's a bit of contact there. Nearly the spoof and uh, Comey. Comey lost a lot of time. He uh, almost had broke himself there, it looked like, and he nearly hit the back spoof, so he had to pull out of it and just about avoid contact. So, uh, yeah. Very yeah. interesting. Chaos against him, just then going through turn one and two. Oh! Ooh. Chaos has just lost his on. entire front wing. He has. Yeah, that's. I just caught the end of that. I don't know what happened there exactly. Um, it looked like it just caught the. Uh... The wall. I tell you what, okay. Villeneuve going very wide in this battle with Tilmo there. Almost like you could fit two more cars in between these two. Villeneuve outbreaks yeah. himself there, but just about manages to keep the position from Tilmo in eighth. As Tilmo gets very, very screwy on the exit there. And we have got just so... focused hand round. He's had a moment. And he is down there in 12th place now. Carnage Achilles. Oh, gets the, he gets the illegal overtake. So Carnage has to allow him back through. Yeah, that's a straight in thing there for Carnage because it wasn't really in a big Yeah, yeah. Did he have a huge that's moment? Point. I don't know, i just point out though, um, the front two are nearly, well, all over 10 seconds ahead of everybody. Yeah, that's a bit crazy. There goes Carnage on just Clovis Hand as well. And was just Clovis Hand had to take huge evasive action because he almost went into the back of the car is in the braking zone there, and that is Chaos into the pits for a new front wing. Yeah, Chaos did start on the hards, but we'll be interested to see what tyre he goes on to and is. I wish you could have the option just to change the front wing a lot of times. Yeah, that would be good. Uh, but he has gone to a set of mediums, so it's a fair shout. I mean, he could potentially long lose him a little bit if he can do. Get these fish and driving and stuff. Okay, that. Uh, Perro, yeah, we're good, thanks. Oh, Perro's in. So, guys, I need to get the, the chat up because, uh, and I can see what you guys uh, are saying. Tita Silva literally has just had a huge moment. Uh, my Twitch, himself. this is not. In yeah. Uh, yeah, Tita Silva outbroke himself. Mark's having got up into third place now. As Carnage uh, not cutting through the field as quick as he's probably hoping he would. Um, a safety car is really going to screw him at the minute. Not with the pole lap. Um, I want to say 27.5. Mason um, out of the session. Can, oh! That could be safety car. That's a full course safety car. Just as I was saying, a safety car now really screws the soft runners. Mason puts it in the wall, safety car's out. Mark 7 guard in the pits, I mean, Zippy as well as it's over. Carnage it does not. So that is Peter Silva on the mediums with Mark 7 God on the cards. Filmo coming in now as well as Carnage Achilles. So let's see where, well what they go on. So, mediums. A lot of drivers going on mediums quite early yet, so we could potentially see these guys along these mediums out and then potentially go into softs for the end, would you say? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Softs last around, I think it was, I want to say 9 or 11 laps here, uh, on the 50%. Uh, okay. I can't remember what the okay. one was doing. I'm sure it was. So that is probably the the best bet would be medium to soft now for those guys at the box for them. Oh, three facts a drive through penalty, speeding on the safety car. We almost, almost has Tita Silver in his in his diffuser as well now down the uh, into the uh, the sweeping right hand there. Kai into the yeah, uh, Kai into the pits. Zippy into the pits. Perfect timing for Zippy though. This has come right at his. Um, this has come very well for Zippy, actually. Yeah. MZ would probably continue on. I'd be shocked to see MZ in. I don't, I 
understand this. I don't know why you're coming in on, on those hearts. Villeneuve stays yeah, out. He... Yeah, see, I'd be staying out as well if I was on the hearts. Yeah, so would I. I would have probably stayed out myself as well, but uh, yeah, it's a Villeneuve. If stays third, the two guys have got out in front of him. That's so, uh. Pit stop. I mean, then again, though, the halves can go to the end now, so. Yeah. Another safety car later on, though. Hmm. Yeah, I reckon they could go to the end for sure now, these halves. Definitely. Um. I think a couple of drivers did it in Pier 2. I'm not 100% sure from what I can remember. Um. But I don't even think there was a safety car in Tier 2. To my knowledge, from what I can remember from being out on track on Tuesday, um, I'm sure we'll have somebody confirm it from tier two in the chat. If there was not a safety car, because I don't believe there was, from what top of my head. Chat's still loading for me. I don't know what is going on at my end tonight. It's very, very strange. Um, you can see the stream, I just... That's just not loading for me. I have all the chat on my PC. Yes. The update says when. I don't think you use the app or anything. Uh, apologies for the mess up on the probation app. Must have flipped the wrong one. Ah, that's alright. It just, it just threw us off to be honest. Obviously, because I couldn't read the... Um, I couldn't read the... Uh, tire now. That was good. Um... Villeneuve, yeah, I, I kind of think Villeneuve's in a good position, but then he'd have only been in a better position if he had come out in front of the two that had just boxed. At the minute, Kai is still very much in control of this race. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, he's got the pace as well, so... Um, Kai definitely has the pace, yeah. I think we should make yeah. the wet tyres. <laughs> full wets, or the intermediates. Yeah, full wets. Full wets. Give everybody else a bit of a chance. And what they have to be on like a uh, very high wear as well, like it's percent. Yeah, I, I kind of feel like Kai could be tier two, uh, tier three, sorry. Oh, definitely. I kind of feel like he's a bit quicker too. Yeah, I do think we could see a few moves up next season potentially into tier three when we see four guys, because a lot of these guys have uh, have got the pace for sure. You know, I think vintage as well. He's not here tonight. Vintage has got some serious pace as well, and uh, he's shown that he missed last week, um, this week as well. And he's still a fair amount of points ahead of everybody else. So, yeah, well, he, yeah was, he's... he was a tier three driver, wasn't he? Yes, yeah, so last season he was. A few of these guys were uh, tier three drivers last season. So, yeah, what can't... I can remember. Can't help but think that some of them would go back to tier three to give the guys that aren't quite as fast as them a chance. Yeah, I think I think Vettel was tier three, Mason was tier three, I think Silver was, Optimistic yeah, was, Vintage I think was as well. Um, so there's a lot a lot of drivers in tier four that were tier three last season. Um, but definitely some of them we will see go back up to tier 3 quicker than I think they'd, ex they'd expected and some would have expected but um, there's still a long way to go in this race, there's still a few races to go this season so it's still all to play for throughout all the tiers um, but this is a big race tonight for Zippy and Carnage and at the moment that looks good Zippy is by far in the best position to um, get back into the title get properly back into that title fight because with those 18 points yeah, that's going to take him to B2 well. yeah safety car in this lap so as you can see Kai now back in the pack up keep it nice and smooth and um, he will be putting his foot down very very soon when those green flags are waved and that safety car is in the lane going around the final corner now taking a nice wide line to probably get an extremely good exit and there he goes puts the power down and gets an extraordinary start as well as the zippy over the rest of the field. Yeah, I mean they're, um, kind of, so. I mean, they're almost a second clear of Vilna in third place. Mark said, well, who's the closest? Actually, it's going to be Tita Silva and MZ. As Tita Silva had a little look um, on MZ, but MZ also had a pretty big look at Mark 7 God there uh, in 
fourth place. Tita Silva very close. Um, I can I can see these three changing positions very very quickly. As Mark Seven God yeah. gets incredibly out of shape, so does then MZ, and Tita Silva down the inside looking for a move, pushed over the over the top curve there. We got a spinner. That's Villeneuve. Oh wow, Villeneuve has a spin. That's not what that Alpha Romeo brothers would have wanted and gets a bit scurly as he gets back underway as well because uh, when those tyres are overheated oh who's that in Spanish it's a Ferrari or oh, is that oh, it's Carnage Silver just it is Carnage Peter Silva's just hit the back of Mark Seven God as well there yeah Carnage is span around on the straight something's happened there on the straight so it's going bad to worse for Carnage today But yeah, those two, two front two guys have already pulled. Well, Zippy's two and a half seconds in front of MZ and Heisen nearly pulled a second on Zippy, so those front two are in the league of their own today. Uh, yeah, they do seem to be. And there goes Tita Silva down the inside of Mark Seven got into the final few corners. And that is Tita Silva up into fourth place now. As we've got Spoofex and Kobe San uh, at the same corner, in fact, as Kobe San just about stays ahead. But Kamisan into the pits, so he's got damage. He must have damage. And that's yeah. Kamisan into the pits once again on those mediums, so he could go back onto the hards now uh, and finish this race off on those hards. Khan span again at the last corner. And he does go back onto the hards, so yeah, Khan is not having a great race at all this season. He's done oh. a very, very good qualifying time, but had a bit of an up and down qualifying as a, as a whole, and that's just continuing. Yep. I was going to turn the lights on for um, yeah. Sam and I'll be back in two seconds. No problem at all. So guys, while Sipper goes off to do what he needs to do, let's see who he is on board with. And he is on board with Mark 7 God, who I am also on board with, who he is currently running down the Mercedes driver of Deep Silver. And these guys have seem to have had a pretty good battle so far this race. So the most entertaining part of this Grand Prix so far. And um, yeah, everybody's kind of spacing out a little bit now after this safety car restart. Uh, Kai's pulled a 1.5 second gap on the driver of Zippy, and then about the same gap to M7 for Zippy's pulled. So um, everybody a little bit spaced out, not too much going on at the moment. Booth is having a look on Chaos Druid down this back bit now, and he's using all that battery already. Booth only 6% battery left compared to Chaos Druid's. 40, so DRS now enabled a spoof one has run a little bit wider in chaos because says thank you he gets that seventh place back but spoof comes into the pits to take his drive through I believe it's easy to get a drive through for speeding under the under the um safety car so yeah spoof taking that drive through now which will probably demote him either way back probably behind his teammate or just ahead of him he is coming out of the pits now, yeah, he is going to come out ahead of his teammate. So Spoof taking that drive through, but uh, no problem. Mark Seven Gods actually had a moment or so, I was looking at that, and he is now quite oh, far behind Peter well, so Silva. Oh, yeah, I didn't quite see him. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, all over the place, he's almost yeah. passed. Down the inside into the, the braking zone. Is... Ooh, very, very close together. to the comfort there. Wow. We'll get another opportunity now after this time. Yeah, he will, yeah. Of this Miami circuit. Uh, yes, can get a this good is exit. PlayStation, but we've also got PC and Xbox. Um, but this is the PlayStation tier. Um, yeah, so... Oh, well, this is one of four PlayStation tiers. Uh, this yes, is tier four at the moment. So Monday is tier one, Tuesday is tier two, Wednesday is tier three, and Thursday tier four. Uh, Thanks for the follow there, and Cow on duty, thanks for the follow nine minutes ago as well, I appreciate that. Well, we appreciate yeah, that, um, Yeah, and we do also have our PC tier as well as two tiers PC, and that is on a Monday and a Tuesday. Every PlayStation tier is run at 10pm, 10pm BST, and the PC is run at 8pm BST, so... Yeah, we have bases from on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday for the PlayStation, and Monday, Tuesday for the PC. Uh, yes, we do. Uh, if you want to go onto that server, fill out the uh, the forms there, and uh, you can get yourself trialed, etc. Through there. If you need any help, the guys in the in the server will help you out, my man. 
Because I can't see the chat, so I'm just going off by what you are saying yourself. <laughs> so. uh, no worries. Here comes Tilmo once again on MK7. God, he's gone around the outside this time. Um, pace advantage there is crazy. Uh, no worries, mate. No worries. Uh, he's outbroke himself, though. Tilmo making a real mess of this tonight. He's making a lot of hard work for himself. He's, he's been ahead twice yeah. and just at the same place, just not getting that breaking zone right. And um, yep. definitely making a meal of it. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty hungry. We'll talk about food on Monday night. He's definitely making a meal uh, uh, Thursday night, so he's definitely making a meal of it there. We've got uh, a plate full of two yeah. of those. Do indeed. And uh, Kai has pulled a 2.2 second gap That's now crazy, on Zippy. Yeah, crazy. Yeah, it's Kai's way ahead of him on the last couple of points. So. He, he kind of knew that if he had that sort of gap, he may not even need to overly push it in this race today. He could just drive at a, a comfortable pace, but where he's not 100% on the limit. Um, so, who's this image on the lobby? I'm not too sure who that is, actually. If that's a session. Oh, yeah, who is that? No idea who that was, so um, very interesting there. No one that um, I recognise. Oh, Melo Space no. Villeneuve. Did Villeneuve have a moment because Melo's just out of nowhere? right up to the back of Villeneuve and I've got a feeling that he has because he was looking oh there goes Melo Space he, well. he has done well there he's kept that out of the wall he's done very well uh, Tilmo MK7 God once again at the same place he's going to be is this going to be third time lucky for Tilmo I think he's too far behind this time uh, yep. yes he is way too far behind but he's managed to nail that breaking point this time so if he gets another bite, another bite of the cherry, he knows exactly where to go. MZ and yeah. Zippy getting very close to each other, coming out on the left hander. We're gonna have DRS here in MZ as he closes in on Zippy for P2. Yeah, and also Mellow Space. I don't believe he's got wing damage. I can't see it though from the uh to view. It doesn't look like that Aston Martin is damaged, but I mean that Aston Martin car. It it is not even in the, the best looking car on the grid. And when it's got that medium, those medium tyres on it, all different matches, it just looks lovely. But um, yeah, that Master Martin doesn't seem damaged, but I do feel that those rear tyres are going to be a bit overheating slightly, would you say? Yeah, the mediums do look quite nice, don't they? It's very yellowy. It's, 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 yeah, it does look very nice, actually. I mean, I, I, I drive yeah. the uh, Aston Martin in my own league. Yeah, Aston Martin. Yeah, it's, 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 it's made out of... Um, made out of glass though, you hit a wall and it just falls apart. But it will be interesting to see if he does pick because uh, there was a glitch on this one as well where... Oh, he's locked up. MZ. MZ and Zippy. DRS. Goes to the outside. This is where Tilmo's been making a meal of it the previous few laps. Can MZ get the move made? He's round the outside. He's going to switch to the inside. MZ and Zippy very close together, but MZ does get the move made. Zippy just tucking in behind him now, and he's going to have a, a bite at MZ down into uh, the final few corners as we come out of this left-hander, but I think Zippy's, yeah. Zippy's way too far behind. He's not even going to have DRS, is he? No, he's not. He's really, really struggling already on those hard tyres. Yeah, he's not got um, DRS. No, he's not. It seems like MZ, even on those mediums, aren't the same um, amount of time spent on those tyres. Those mediums still seem better, seem better um, than those hards. Oh, um, Carnage in the wall. Yeah. Oh, Carnage just reset the track. Did he? Yeah. Oh, that will be one for the stewards to have a little look at after this race is finished. Um, He's not, not managing to keep up. No, not. Very, very interesting. Maybe give it a few laps. And we could see those odds start to come into their own, own again once those mediums slightly drift off. Um, I'll tell you what, Tilmo uh, is nowhere near Mark Seven God behind it. He's very, uh, he's drifted back as well now. So, Carnage into the pits, brand new set of softs again for yeah. Carnage. I don't know what's happening. I mean, I think it's this track, and it just seems to catch everybody out of this track. I don't think anyone is what I would class as completely comfortable, unless you're named Kai. 
I just, yeah, even when I raced on Tuesday, it was, it, I was far from comfortable. It was just a case of just trying to get this car over the line, just to try and secure some, take, take away some points. Because yeah, I mean, it's incredibly slippy when, when you're yeah, on all tires. When I was here, um, it's definitely not a no traction track. I feel like a lot of drivers, well, a lot of drivers that I race with, who yep. are non traction drivers, actually turn traction to medium for this track because it was almost impossible to put the traction down in so many different parts of this track. They were still yep. wheel spinning in fifth. That's just crazy, and to be fair though, when I did my race on Tuesday, I did not actually use a setup. I actually used the increased top speed preset, but yeah, changed the chain. I just literally changed the um, tire pressures a little bit and just a couple of other things. But um, I just felt like on that one, the rear is a little bit more forgiving. Um, but like, I leave about 0.2 on the straight, but. When people used all their batteries, and I saved my battery, I was literally using no time to them on the straights. Yeah. So it kind of evened out, if you get what I mean. And throughout these twistier sections, it's a little bit more uh, stable. Yeah, on the website, if you create the account and register, then yeah, that's fine. As here comes Tillman and he's got the inside of the car. So I don't know what he's doing. Yeah, he's got the inside light. He has the move made once again. And again, he's locked up. Why? He's, he just, I don't know. It's as if he just doesn't want P5. It is, yeah. He's just like, no, do you know what? I'm just going to settle for P6. But he's going he's gonna to do it. Oh, yeah. my God, he was so close to the there. He's going he to do that soon. He's going to literally lock up too much. Yeah. Oh, this, is, this is tier four. I mean, there's an academy that obviously you have to do a race in first to see what your pace is. Um, but I mean, tier four is, it's not slow, I wouldn't say it's slow, I mean, they're slower than tier one, obviously, but... They want a rapid. Um, tier two is, I mean, I, I, I would say tier four is for many of the, big, like, not beginners, but newcomers, and, you know, and then you work your way up through. I don't, I mean, it's not that confusing over there, mate. It's, it's very, it's a very simple form to fill out. And if you have yeah. any issues, um, one of the guys in the chat will definitely help you. Yeah. Zippy gets a three. Oh, that's that's huge. That is big, actually. Yeah, I'd I hear one of just in some of those drivers. Some of the lot of times they were setting and qualifying, which was nuts. It was crazy. Um, but yeah, it was. Yellow flag. Is that hard catching. No, it's Spoof X. Spoof's had a moment. What an average lap time was. for tier four. I mean. That's the fastest lap at the minute. I mean, it's varying from a 131.7 to a 136.4. That's the average lap times in a race here at the moment. That's their fastest laps. Yeah. So you've got anything from a 31.7 down to a 36.4. Yeah. I can try and find out what the other ones were. He won. Oh, Carnage into the wall again. Mellow Space has spun as well. I can see Carnage into the pits and uh, being our second retiree of the race. And we've got a safety car, actually. We do. We have a safety car, guys. Kai, on those 11 lap old cars, 11 laps to go. Uh, yeah, it was about a 129, yeah. Yeah, what's that for? For Polly. Yeah, about that. Um, yeah, it was between 129 and 131 in qualifying. Uh, in fact, I think I'm pretty sure Kai done 127. No, he didn't do 127. Oh, look what he did. He did. He did, didn't he? He did a 127.912. Yeah, so. And then P2 was a 128.8. Yeah, so it was between a 127 and a 131, I think it was. Yeah. Uh, tier 3 yesterday, the pole lap was. It was actually raining, so that's irrelevant. Um, it doesn't really make 
any justice to say that one. Um, let me find out what tier 2 was, because that was dry. Um, tier 2 was a... Kai's into the pits, MZ into the pits, Zippy had already pitted, but continues on. Mellow Space into the pitch, and Kani's into the pit. I tell you what, this, this safety car has theoretically saved Carnage and Mellow Space's race because they now mm -hmm. are, able, are able to stay on the lead lap. Yep, they are indeed. Um, the same now. Kai's whole lap would have put him P4 into a 2. Oh. Oh, there yeah. we go. But bear in mind that yeah. Kai had just done uh, a qualified and 25% racing. Ah, and, and, okay. and and even in and even in um, the academy race, he was racing against the PC drivers, and I think he put it third. Um, wow. Okay. A Quasar put it on pole with Nick in P2. And I think it was Kai in P3. Yeah, but Kai's pole up, as I said, very impressive. When you think about it, P4, a tier 2. That's yeah. um, definitely... Um, Just out of curiosity, right? That'll put him in, P1, in tier 1. Oh, that'll put him in tier 1. I will have a look. It's good, it's good to see what, uh, what he would do. I definitely, I definitely think he's tier 2, tier 3 driver. I'm definitely saying top 10 for tier 1. Uh, 8, I believe. Yeah. I believe about 8. And uh, saying that, he was in there. 7th, 8th and 9th would have been separated by three, uh, two thousandths of a second. So, yeah. It would have been incredibly close in tier 1 if he was in there that lap time. Um, but yeah, he's just been put into P8, which is very interesting. Yeah, definitely. So I was just talking to my daughter. She was um, no the time she has to go to bed. No problem. That's all. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, he's he's definitely he's definitely got some pace. He just came to stand uh, speeding and quickly. He's he's definitely got some pace. That's Kai. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah, Zippy staying out. So that's quite bold decision, but it, it could potentially pay off because those softs could die off and then he could potentially pick up the pieces, but he does have that time penalty, which is going to play a part, for sure. Uh, yeah, I just saw there, I'm not sure who that was, was that, someone just picked up a 5 second, I think it was... Meadow Space? Was it Meadow Space that just picked up a 5 second? I don't know. I, I know that he, he has got one, along with Spoof and Cobby Sam. It was a um, ignoring yellow flags. Incident. Very interesting. Yeah. His uh, mellow space it was, it had was a bit of a moment. Space, yeah, for ignoring the yellow flags. So he did have a bit of a moment and his car ghosted, so um, I'm sure actually. what happened. It looks like he may be yeah. going to serve that now. It wouldn't do it though, would it? Because it's on the safety car. Yes, yeah, he, it will. He, he will. As Chaos gets a... Chaos gets a five second as well. I'm not sure what's going on here. Is there a glitch going on? But Mello has just retired from the session as well. Okay. Hmm. Sorry, the safety car's... Coming in, isn't it? Yeah, because no, Kai's backed off. Yeah, I think. Uh, no, it's going to be next lap. Next lap. Yeah. Um, yeah, it stayed out for quite a considerable amount of time, actually, this safety car. Yeah, it well, it feels like it has, anyway. Um, but yeah, this will mean that 
it will come in at the end of lap 20, 21, sorry. Which leaves us with about, what, six laps racing? Uh, yeah, so... Bit of a little sprint end to this Grand Prix, and I think the soft runners now will definitely be happy that it's doing all the lap because it's that's where when you're just following the safety car and you're not overly you're not pushing those tires at all. So I mean, I feel like Carnage. I don't know, I don't think Carnage is out of this because the softs are going to wear quite quickly. When I space leaving the session, I, I, I still think Carnage can get some relatively good points. Potentially, for sure, yeah. Uh, I, mean, he's a bit of... I, I have no idea, mate. I don't know what they get to see, unfortunately. Surely the safety car has to come in this lap because it's been out for like three laps, three laps now, two laps. Now. Yeah, this, this is the third and final lap the safety car's out. Yeah, it has to, yeah. Um, to be honest with you, Matt, I think people were just making things up to put in there. Just put anything in there. You could live at one, two, three Sesame Street if you like. Yeah. I don't think, I don't think it really matters. Oh, is that for the um, sign ups? Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Kind of where you you put your kind of where you're from. You mean you don't have to if you don't want to. If you, like you said, just put something random if you want to do that. If you don't want to kind of put like the city or whatever, um, you know it depends how you're comfortable. With. Yeah, and here we go. Then safety car is in this lap yeah, now. So safety car is coming back, this back lap. Up. I tell you what, Carnage just had another moment on the safety car. Oh, it's a Ferrari is very unstable. Carnage Achilles. Yeah, here we go, the guys oh, warming their tyres up. Holy sand, severe collision with, with chaos. It almost drives into the back of him again. I'm not sure if that's just... Um, the cars ahead of him slowed down, or if he's just become a little bit impatient. But the guy that. has already dropped the anchor, and he's got himself a nice little run on MZ, actually. He has, yeah. And they've pulled Peter a considerable gap. Third. Zippy down to fourth. Wow. Into he can turn have one the best start. Very good move. Very good move. Yeah, well, well the front two have already pulled 1.6 seconds on the pack. So... Oh, just Curry Curry Sands Sands the session. And that has ghosted his car, which promotes carnage into the points. So... On this hard drive. I, I will try my best to. Bear with me one second. I believe I do have him on my business, but I uh, can try and get my this is a repeat of last week. It was um, Chaos versus Carnage last week. Uh, which is interesting two names. Chaos Chaos and Carnage. And, uh, last week it actually ended up in Cardiff because Chaos hit the wall and spun. Since Komi Sam was last online a moment ago, so Komi Sam might be done. Uh, Vilner will have to move Vets at the moment, so he's going for the move. This is P7, and going for the move he is. There's no DRS you ever die, so he'll get a DNA with him. Not this time, but the next time they cross the line. Yep. Very close to me, so Kai says another part of that with 31.2. Yeah. Probably that there from um, Kai. And um, yeah, they just want to still have that. That's why I said just make yeah. make a, a random name and address and thing up. That's that's what we said. We said make it up so it doesn't have to be your real address, real name, and a real number and things. Just just make the stuff up. Yeah, it doesn't have to be the real they, They've asked more of a, a security, maybe a val validation thing. Um, but I mean, that's what we've all had to do. Even even us commentators, we've had to do it. So yeah, we've had to. Yeah, it's it's part of, part of part of the racing game, right? Because it's, it's not you know, yeah. just makes me go. So, 
it's just an email address. So just the email address has to be right, but your name, address, and, and, and phone number, just put what you want in there. The email address is not be funny, mate. You, you have to have an email address to to register for uh, a Facebook account. You have to have one to to register for your PlayStation account. So you know, it's it's, it's a secure form. I mean, I've I've been here. Well, Chappers has been here over a, what, a year. Uh, I think about six, seven months now. Six, seven months, and we will have to do it as well, mate. Yeah, it's fine. Trust me. If it just the email has to be correct, but any everything else you can put something random, as we've said. Um, it doesn't have to be the real thing. Real nerve and Spoofex <coughs> into turn one. Spoofex has gone very wide into turn one, uh, and that's actually allowed Real Nerve to really close in on him. Carnage over a second behind Real Nerve on those hard. I did say that the uh, the hards would start coming to him <coughs> towards the end of this race. And that's what they are doing. The mediums on Zippy will start coming to him as well against these socks. Five racing laps to go. The OS has now been enabled. And uh, the soft runners are going to start. Uh, start sucking. In fact, Zippy and Tina Silver. Uh, I do not know how to delete the account. No. I'm not an admin, I'm just a commentator. Why would we need to delete the account? If it's the fact that you don't want to race here, then obviously just, just leave the server, I guess. Um, I mean, if, it, if it's because of the whole registration thing, a lot of leagues nowadays are, are making are doing it. sign up. Yeah, you, have, you, you do it, yeah. A lot uh, of, Zippy a lot, ran a lot, the of Tina Silva into third place. Tina Silva just tucked in behind. Uh, Mark 7 God and Silva changing position. Mark 7 God has finally... Finally lost P5 to Tilmo. It's taken 25 laps. Tilmo has finally got P5. Carnage Achilles versus Chaos. Carnage into 8th place now. I did say the hardest oh. stuff coming back to him. Yep. It was my number, that's all. I've just changed it. Okay. What you Okay. It's fine. Vilna Decided. chasing Mark 7 God. So Mark 7 God at risk here of uh, actually losing fifths and sixth. He has DRS. Mark 7 God does not have DRS. Zippy and Tina Silver changing positions once again. And here goes Vilna down the inside. Vilna into sixth place and Mark Seven God down to seven. Chaos gets Carnage. Oh, and Carnage into the wall. And that is going to be Carnage's wow. race over. That's safety car. It is a full brain safety car. That's big. Everybody onto the soft end for a two lap shootout. You'd think they'd probably do that. You'd think. Let's see what happens. Nope. Kai's staying out. And they're staying out. PT the silver staying in, Zippy staying in. I think everybody's just gonna stay out. Tilmo in. I think Tilmo feels that he can uh oh. Rona then. Mark Seven staying in. Chaos staying in. Booth in. Carnage is gonna have to be in. He's gonna have I, to be in. I think um Tilmo's fancying a little bit more of a uh, Bit of a charge here. The last, the last couple of lap charge. Yeah. But what that has done is that's promoted Mark of God back into fifth place. It has indeed. And those guys on this fresh set are also going to have to push to the absolute limits to try and get through the pack. who are on the um. Young set of sauce, there's probably only going to be, like you said, a couple of lap dash and then it's done. Yeah. yeah sure. I mean, well, when the race last season elsewhere, I had a late safety car at Abu Dhabi and it was literally a last lap shootout. It was crazy. Uh, yeah, it was actually. Yeah. We had another safety car to end this, end this race. 
I've discovered that this game tends to give out a lot of say, full blown safety class for just debris on the track, but like a full blown crash, it will just bring out a virtual safety car. Yeah, I have noticed that as well. Yeah, I also noticed that if it's set to standard, it'll do it for debris. If it's set to reduced, it doesn't. Right, who are you? Hollywood Clay. Oh, I've, I've got no a horrible that. feeling that this has been set to friends only. I think so as well. Yeah. I don't know who's made the lobby, but that it could right. be the case. It could be, I've seen a couple of people who we've got no idea who it is. I'm into the lobby. Um, so, yeah. Very interesting what is currently going on. But, uh, definitely I'm going to see potentially the safety car come in at the end of lap 27. Well, this two lap shootout. It is my best guess because, uh, Carnage and Perry Sun are just coming. Perry Sun is not even racing. Um, Kind of just stuck behind the ghost and he can't overtake it, which well, is the most. It does. I think it's letting through now. Yeah, it has letting through. Okay, that's good. Very interesting why Komi Sun left the session and just went off mid race. Um, maybe it was just an out of frustration for what was going on, but uh. Two for all the Saturday night and the 10th haven't had the best of luck today, that's for sure. No, I'm considering Carnage was... Uh, oh, internet won't. I'll go. Considering Carnage had the prime chance tonight. He did, to, uh, yeah. make a huge inload on the two, uh, on the two ahead of him. Yeah. You know, it's, a bit, it's a bit unfortunate for him. It is, yeah. And as well, Zippy, this could affect him massively because he's got that time penalty and if a couple of these drivers behind him stay within that radius of him, he's going to lose valuable, valuable points potentially. And he's the other driver that needed to get a good amount of points here today and if he loses the time to the guys behind him, he could drop down two or three, if not more, positions, potentially. Uh, absolutely, yeah. I mean, Zippy's penalties really, really hurt him. Um, yeah. Chaos's penalties have hurt him. Spoof, it's just going to go from bad to worse. I mean, you could find that Carnage on those new lap, the new tyres could, could in fact gain a few positions. Um, Maybe. On hmm. this restart, but it has to be a perfect restart for him. And it also cannot have a restart with a spin. Uh, Tilmo, I think that is, is absolutely jumping all over the place. Yep. And as they get ready to go race again for the last two lap dash of this Grand Prix. Guys put the hammer down. Uh, Tita yeah. Silva, however, has got a really good run this time. He has. And Chaos has gone early and he's got a five second penalty for ignoring the yellow flags. Ow. Uh, they've gained it. does give the position back. We've got a spinner. Chaos is round. Mm. Oh, I need time to get. That's a disaster. Disaster. Well, that, what's happened though? It's actually promoted Spoof and Carnage into seventh and eighth now. It has, yeah, it has. Because Tilmo's had a moment. Tilmo's done in ninth. Carnage going around the outside of his teammate. That's very risky. A bit of contact there between the two Ferraris. Well, then they're both the fighting for the only championships. Pardon? You would think that Spook would let Carnage go because of his penalty to try yeah. and get maximi maximise the points for the team. As Spook is just absolutely... No, I think he's outbroke himself in, in, the, in his defence there. And he's just come back on in front of Tilmo and almost put Tilmo in a wall. Well, OK, so a bit of a dangerous rejoin there for Spook after he ran a bit wide right there. All over the back of Mark Seven got though, as Kai already just under a second as uh, Tilmo gets past Spook and up into eighth place. Carnage in seventh place now. Now I tell you what, Carnage could be looking at a sixth place finish here if he can get past Villeneuve. Uh, Tita Silva into second place. Oh, oh Carnage had to take some invasive action there. And Tita Silva's gotten past NZ, as you said. 
MZ straight back the ins on the inside of the De Silva, so a good battle there for the second place. Uh, yeah, that, yes, seriously, yeah. It's, it's, it's for, um, to make sure that you're going to have a decent connection for, to the lobby, mate. I mean, it's, it's really quite, quite standard stuff, to be honest. So if you have bad, you know, if somebody's internet isn't yeah, like you great. Yeah, someone's got like, I don't know, one gigabyte per second download speed and, and you're, you're sat there and you're literally One going, megabyte, you mean? Yeah, one megabyte. I would say, you know, KB, it's even worse, you know, you know what I mean? The worst possible yeah. internet you can get. You don't want that and then you're sat there, you just literally don't know where the car is. So yeah, I mean... It's it's standard to keep the, the lobby and the connections clean, so then it should Carnage generate into more sixth place fair now. Last lap of this race, Carnage up into sixth, looking at fifth place because of Zippy's penalty. Yeah, as I say, there is a ticket bot in Discord. I mean, as I said, mate, no, no nobody's forcing you to fill out the form. It's it's just. Um, what needs to be done if you want to race here? Okay, I mean, you know. But here comes Kai coming across the line to take the checkered flag. He does win. MZ in second place and Tita Silva into third. Zippy will finish fourth but drops. Carnage into fifth place. So he does, in fact, pick up 10 points um, and closes the gap to those ahead of him in the championship as they were missing this evening. I mean, everybody's had to do it. Uh, like I said, if you're unhappy filling it out, nobody's forcing you. Right? You know, it's just a time you can always potentially go and find someone else to race in, I guess. Um, you know, we'd love to have you racing, but you know, if you don't want to build the form out, then that's fine. Yeah, Exa exactly what Chapa said. But there we go, there's Kai. He wins this evening here in round six, Miami, for tier four. Um, to be fair, overall, a pretty decent race. Yes. Kai showed some serious, serious pace tonight. He did. Um, yeah. So I don't know if you've noticed as well, but in the, in, in the, um, the crowd at, at the podium, yeah. Arava stood there as well. You obviously know Arava is the chief Of course, yeah. He's he's actually uh, he's actually in the uh, he's actually in the game, isn't he? So is uh, Ted Daly. That's cool. But here we have your and our final finishing positions of this Miami Grand Prix in the last race of this week. And then this guy in the cloud will taking the victory with MZ in second place and TJ Silver rounding off the podium. With Phil Nolan fourth, Carnage Achilles in, in fifth, with and Mark Seven in sixth, Zippy in seventh. Tormo in 8th, Boost in 9th, with Kami San running off the points finishers in 10th. Ash Jury having a bit of an unfortunate end to his Miami Grand Prix in 11th, with Mellow Space in 12th and Mason in 14th. Absolutely. So, yeah, guys, that is your tier 4 and round 6 week rounded up here in Prospect. Um, pretty certain that we're not going to I think it's Monza next week. Oh, Vilna. Is Vilna on the podium? No, he's not. Uh, he's still in the driver. Yeah, so Monza next week. Uh, and it doesn't look like we're doing podium. Um, yeah, we, don't seem to, we haven't really seen to do podiums all week, actually. Uh, it's been a no, couple of not. weeks now. Um, yeah. But yeah, it, it, it is what it is, guys. Um, but yeah, we're back again Monday night with myself. And I think... Uh, Luke for tier one and then uh, hopefully it should be Feldman and Artistic back for tier two on Tuesday uh, uh, Solid Elite and Artistic for tier three myself on Academy on Thursday followed by tier four and myself and Chappers again next week but uh, thanks very much for tuning in guys hope you've enjoyed the stream hope you've enjoyed the racing and I hope you've enjoyed round six here in Prospect this week we look forward to seeing you all again next week. Monday from 10 o'clock on the PlayStation Tears. From now, I've been Zippo. I've been Choppers. We'll see you again next week. Good night, guys.